Yo, good morning guys. How are we all doing? And my name is of course FJ. Today we're just going to be doing another little vlog. Just going through what we're going to be doing today. And pretty much that's all I wanted to say for now. Got a lot of cool things going on today. Let's go. First thing we're going to be doing is probably just jumping into a video. So I've got to record a main channel video. I've got to do, yeah, I've got to do two main channel videos today. Uh, recording and doing all of that. So I've got a lot going on today. So I need to get those two done now pretty much. So it's going to be an Overwatch video and a Black Ops video hopefully. If all goes well, but we'll see. There is however a slight issue we're going to record now, which I've just realised. I have obviously got my package going today, which is pretty much the main point of today's video, which is the new camera bag. And if we miss out on the camera bag today, then I don't really know what I'm going to do for most of today because I'm actually seeing a friend, which I can't really vlog because I feel rude doing that. But also, secondly, um, we have recording to do, which I can't vlog because I can't record and vlog at the same time. So it's like I have to make, I have to basically make a video about this this bag. That was the point of today's video. So I don't know what to do. Do I wait till I get the bag, or do I just make a video and hope that the guy doesn't come until after I've done the video? I don't know. All right, so it's ten o'clock now, and pretty much what we're going to be doing from now is just focusing on making sure that I get this package because pretty much getting the package is a big part of today. So I'm I'm just I'm just going to wait here pretty much till I get the package. Um, I really do need to record Overwatch though, so I do need to do that. We will do that at some point for sure. It's all right for you, mate. You've got nothing to do today. You just sit there and get walked. Actually, you know what? Let's just go play Overwatch. Let's record some. Let's do a video now, and then we should be good to go for later. And then we'll be able to make a video on the bag when it comes, and I won't feel stressed about not doing a video. That makes sense. Let's go do it. All right, so I just finished recording Overwatch. Um, I'm gonna go record some Call of Duty in a bit, but right now I'm just gonna go watch some South Park, so let's go do that. You know what, let's get some lunch. It's here. Let's do it. Alright, so fundamentally, this bag is going to be used pretty much for photography gear. That is pretty much all it's for. Let's go for a little bit of cameras. So this is the completed one. So right now we have the D7000. We have a section for the battery and some little bits like card readers and card cases and stuff. External flash. This is still obviously my D7000 with the main camera lens at the moment. Then I've got my 55300 and then I have just cleaning stuff. So like lens cleaning and uh, just general camera care stuff in there. That's pretty much it for the moment. I haven't actually opened the main bit yet, but we'll do that in a sec. Just quickly, let's just have a quick look at what this can do. This is designed for being a DSLR, pretty much camera bag, right? So it's got cabin luggage certified, so like obviously you can use on planes and stuff. Uh, external tripod connections, which I will show you when I actually buy one. Uh, interchangeable dividers, flexi dividers, that is basically the bits you see at the front where I obviously I put my camera in. That is all custom, right? So like I, I designed the flexors, the, the, whatever the hell they're called. Water repellent and laptop compatible up to a 15 inch laptop. That's pretty cool. I'll show you all in a sec. Okay, so basically inside here, you have this section here, which literally just opens up and you've got a sleeve in there. All this like super cool camo lining, which is like, it, it looks super nice. And then obviously in here you have all of your genuine products. You have 
the little Manfrotto logo, which is cool. You've literally just got a small compartment in here. It's not that big in here. That's one thing to bear in mind. Most of it is taken up by the camera compartment just down here. And then obviously up here, you do have your laptop sleeve, which is literally just in here. And so this can fit 15 inch laptop in it, if you like. Dedicated laptop sleeve. This is all water resistant as well, which is good to go. So I thought I would do a quick little look at this bag and just go through what I think are the main bits of it, like the good good things and what I'm actually using it for. So in the front, literally here, I am not using this for anything. This is just empty at the moment. I'm gonna use it eventually for putting in, I might even use it for putting in this camera here, the one I'm filming this on, my Sony WX500. But I predominantly will be using this for things like sunglasses, uh, just like passes, things like that, or like a wallet or something, I don't know. I'll use it for that, just, it's, it's it's pretty well protected, like the zip is actually underneath like a little slip thing, so it's not just like anyone can get in. Uh, in this main section in up here, so there's like two of those side pockets, this one is used for like medicine. In the main section, I actually have a hard drive here, I have three pens, I have a power brick, like a UK power brick to a USB adapter, and then underneath that I have a USB cable, uh, like a USB to micro USB cable and I also have a USB to USB type B cable in here. I then also have my AKG Y50s and as well as that a notebook and a massive 12,000 milliamp portable battery pad which can power my camera and also my phone. So that's a go. In this top section here, I don't have it on me right now but it's in the other room. But I'm going to be putting, I'm doing some work on it right now so I can't actually put it in but i am doing i'm gonna be putting in here my chromebook this is a really really nice little place see my uh, 11 inch chromebook it's the n22 from lenovo i think it is it's a pretty good chromebook it's pretty basic it only cost me like 100 pounds um, and yeah overall though i'm really impressed with this bag there are two bits i'm probably never going to use which are here and this one although you can use them apparently to put tripods in so i don't know i might use them for tripods one day but we'll see about that. Overall though, this bag is an absolute go, like 100% recommend it. It is the street backpack from Manfrotto. I paid for this myself. This was a 100 pound bag. So it is expensive. Uh, it's actually quite cheap on Amazon. I think it's 100 pound on Amazon. It's like 110 for Manfrotto himself. So it's an expensive bag. Um, it's a really good bag though. I would definitely recommend it. I haven't actually used it properly though. I haven't gone out or, or tried shooting with it and I haven't actually tried fitting this camera in, which would be the real test. So we'll probably go through, when I get all my full setup, like my new lens and my tripod, we'll probably set this all up properly and I'll do a more in-depth video talking about everything that's in my bag. Yo, so that's pretty much been it for today. I mean, I am going out later, so I, I, well, I think I'm going out later. I haven't quite decided, but I've got work. I've got to go to take the dog for a walk. I've got to go to work and then I've also probably am going out later. I'm not quite sure yet. But if I am going out, I will take the camera with me, but I'm just gonna say goodbye now because I don't actually know if I'm going to properly do anything then um but yeah if i do add anything else in it will literally just be just to music and we'll just leave it out from there but thank you very much for watching my name's been fj and goodbye